Hello everyone and welcome to this video. It's Lenat here again from thelenat.com and in today's video tutorial I'm going to share with you three different ways you can use the Meta Fishers board to start automating your Fishers trading on Binance. All right. So there are three different um, options you have. Okay. Um, that you can actually start using the Meta Fishers board to start automating all of your trades on your Binance account. Okay. And you know start making profit on a daily basis so if i go ahead and open up the the app all right so this is the meta features app i already signed off an account if you don't have an account already you use the link in the video description to sign off an account so once you create your account you log in to the app it brings you to this interface i focus that there are other different bots okay you can use you can use the board for spot trading you can use it for gaming and all these other options you have here but our interest here is on the um, Fisher's trading and it will cost you 150 USDT to activate this board for a year. Okay, so I'll go ahead and click on the Fisher's trading. And once I click on the Fisher's trading, it brings us to this interface. All right, so this is how the board looks like. And all we just need to do is bind this to our Binance. Okay, we'll bind it to our Binance um, using API. All right, then um, this way your funds are saved. On your Binance account all the board needs to do is just to be trading on your behalf all right it doesn't touch anything on your Binance account so you don't have anything to fear because your funds are already secured on your Binance account so all of the trades are carried out on Binance and then the profit you make all of them are on your Binance account okay so if I go ahead and um, I've already made a video on how to bind this all right I will leave the link in the video description and um, after you binded the account, the first thing, the next thing you need to do, after you binded your account, the next thing you need to do is to activate the account. And the easy way to activate the account is if you click on this menu icon, okay, these three lines at the top right. So if you click on it, um, you see where it says deposit, okay? So just click on the deposit. Now, because it costs you 150 USDT, um, you want to deposit more let's say you deposit 250 will be used as your gas fee remember the gas fee is where the board charges their own fee from okay so once you make a deposit of 150 to this wallet or 200 150 will be used to automatically activate the board for you and you are going to use it for a whole year and then the other 50 will be left as your gas fee okay so once you make the deposit you will see here that it will be reflecting here that it is active okay once it is active then whatever you have on your asset here okay whatever you have on your asset here will be for your gas fee all right whenever you run out of gas fee all you just need to do okay whenever you run out of gas fee all you just need to do is to come back here again to the deposit option and you know make a deposit and you are good to go all right so once the board is activated you need to have funds on your binance account okay you need to have funds on your Binance account and the funds on your Binance account has to be on the Fisher's account. Okay, so you need to transfer funds. Let's say you have your USDT in your spot wallet. You need to transfer it from your spot wallet to your Fisher's um, account. Okay, so let me briefly show you that. So if I open up Binance, okay, if I open up Binance and I come in here to where it says here is where you carry out your spot trading, you know, your P2P trading, your um margin trading and the rest but we want to come in here and click on features okay this is where we are concerned what we are concerned with click on features all right and if you don't have funds on your features account all you just need to do is to click on this arrow okay this um yellow arrow face, facing each other so if you click on it it will ask you to transfer funds all right you transfer from your spot wallet to your um features wallet and it has to be the usdm features Okay, because what we are transferring is USDT and it is USDT that we'll be using to trade. So it has to be transferred to the USDT M features. Okay, once you successfully do this, the funds will now be reflecting on your um, bot here. Okay, the bot can only read the phone. It doesn't mean because it's reflecting here, they are taking over the funds. No, it can only read. Okay, and um, just make sure you check the API, how to bind your API. And once you are done with that, the next thing now is how to trade. This is where we come to the three method, three ways you can actually use um, the, the Meta Features board. Number one is that you can automate the trade using this option called the Edge board. Okay. You can automate all of your trade using this feature called the Edge board. Using the Edge board means that the board will automatically select a coin for you. 
it will automatically take the trade it will automatically take profit step stop loss for you and all of the margin adding everything is automatically done for you okay this method is good for those who um, don't have the time to start doing the trade or monitoring the account you can actually automate this bot and every day you are sure that you'll be making um, money on your account okay so to activate the edge board all right first the first thing you need to do if we come in here to the menu option here we we'll click on it so once i click on it it brings us here so to use the edge board on the automation mode make sure that you check this on this edge mode make sure that it is on and then the save mode can equally be checked on the save mode helps take care of your account in terms of um, liquidation and when the price is not going in your favor so the save mode can actually do um save a lot of you know trade being taken unnecessarily on the account okay so once you enable these two options um if we go back if we go back here um you can now come in here and click on the edge board okay this is the edge board um this one is still in progress i believe very soon they'll finish the work they are doing on the super board all right and we can start using that so if i click on the edge board all right this is where it brings you to i already have this board running so that is why i said edit or stop so i already have the board running so what you want to do is you come in here and put in the number of trades okay number of trade how many trades do you want the board to be taking for you at a time if you say two it means that it can trade um two different coins okay at the same time all right if you say three um normally I advise always use one to be on the safe side okay and then you can put in your first order amount here how much do you want when the bot start trading how much do you want the bot to you know initiate the trade with is it ten dollars is it um, twenty dollars fifty dollars you can go ahead and put in that amount here in your own case if you are just starting up you'll see where it says start somewhere down here so just go ahead and click on start and the bot will start um automatically um uh, trading for you all right so that is how you do that I already have the bot running so i will not be able to stop this right now okay so that is how you'll be able to you know use the first option by just automating the trades for yourself the next option is that you can copy professional traders okay so if i click here there is an icon here like a profile icon the last icon down here okay where i'm circling down here that last icon there is our um copy trading option so if i click on it it brings us to the copy trade interface okay you see that it says that um, i haven't invested yet so when you come in here to the copy trading option you want to scroll down okay these are all the options you have here here you can copy this first trader this trader has about 293 people for copying him or her okay this is again the person has made so far um this person the same thing you continue to see anyone that pleases you you go ahead and click on it okay so if i click on this first option here it will tell us that the minimum we can start copying with is 150 dollars all right so you can start copying this person if you have up to 150 dollars on your account so whenever the person takes a trade the trade automatically reflects on your own end that is what the copy trading is all about okay and these people have more people copying him because he is the lowest so far okay because he has his own is 150 if i click on another option here um if i click on this second person you see that the minimum here is 200 so the minimum this person requires is 200 okay and it goes on and on okay so once you you are satisfied you just go ahead and click on you know start copying okay so when you click on start copying it brings up this option so this is where you now say okay number of trades the same thing you did in the, with the edge board you can go ahead and put the number of trade meaning that if this person is trading like 10 different pairs if you put two here two will be copied out of that for you um if the person at the same time okay that is what it means so just put in one here and then put in the amount as your first order amount just put in the amount there if it is ten dollars twenty dollars whatever it is go ahead and put it and then you click on submit and you can start copying this trader immediately all right that is the third the second this is the second option all right and then the third option which is my favorite but this one needs a bit of um, technical analysis you need to know what you are doing in the market before you can actually use this last option the last option is manual trading okay so it's to manually copy traders on this platform how do you do that um there is a feature here called top gainers and then top losers okay 
to switch to the top losers you just click on this icon here so these are top 10 gainers token or coins in the market right now so if i scroll to the left you see all of them now if i click on this arrow here it will switch it to um, the top 10 losers okay those who are not doing very well in the market you see all of them here all right so you can take advantage of this okay now let's say um bell usdt has been doing very well so if i click on bell here okay you can go ahead this needs a bit of you know some technicalities you know you need to analyze the market you see that on the 15 minutes time frame here all right this has been pumping okay and there is every tendency that it will pump to a level where it has to you know start dropping so what you want to do is to take advantage of that and use the sell short option here and short the market okay if you are as assessing a, a coin that is always um that is very down okay you can go ahead and analyze the market and then you know use the buy long option to buy the market and you can start making gain this one you are the one who is setting all of your perimeters okay for the trades um and there's if i scroll down here there is where it says edit settings here okay that we can actually use if i click on it you set up your own perimeters as against the edge board that does this automatically for you set up your own perimeters and once you are satisfied you go ahead and either sell uh, both long and short or you just use the sell short or the buy long option okay um this one needs a bit of you know trainings and i'll be doing that via my zoom okay and subsequent videos i'll dedicate it to just teaching you how to do the manual trade so these are the three basic options okay of using the um metaphysics board and all of these once again does the trading it was ever you want whether you want to copy traders you want to use the edge board mode or you want to go ahead and use uh, the manual mode all of these are done on your binance so your funds are safe and secure on your binance i just wanted to share with you these three ways and gradually i'll be teaching you all of this in subsequent videos and you know in my zoom meeting so if you do like this video give it a thumbs up and if this is your first time of seeing my video this is the first time to my channel consider subscribing hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published and if you want to learn more okay link to join my telegram group will be in the video description to be able to use this board you need um binance okay you need an active account a verified account with binance if you don't have one already link will equally be in the video description to sign up for an account all right so that is all i have for you in this video and i'll see you guys in the next video